Hello and welcome back, my beautiful froggy army, to another video. As you may or may not be able to tell, I kind of like Squishmallows. They're like this funky, like totally niche kind of like plushy and i just have like a few of them so i kind of want to buy more squishmallows but sometimes sometimes there's companies out there who make fake ones i feel like fake squishmallows have been rising a little bit in popularity as um hard to find squishmallows become more hard to find or more expensive as the prices go up as the quality goes a little bit down on actual squishmallows <laughs> i said what i said and people are more and more inclined to just buy a fake squishmallow just because of accessibility or the price i actually already did a part one to this video so definitely go check that out if you haven't seen it before i bought some fake squishmallows off of amazon and that's what we're going to be doing again today i'm going to be buying more fake squishmallows off of amazon we're going to see what we can find i was actually inspired to do this video again because i found another good fake that i was like mm, this is pretty cute let's do a part two so if you're into that if you're into squishmallows plushies animal crossing definitely subscribe to the channel i would love to have you join the froggy army i post squishmallow content animal crossing content irl content i do vlogs sometimes i would absolutely love to have you here thank you so much also if you see me like moving my arms like this i'm petting my cat she's in my lap Hi, Peach. But anyway, let's get into it. We are here on Amazon.com. I had to click on the Amazon Basics tab because the homepage has like this giant like GIF playing of like sports or whatever. Now, I don't think I saved the link to the one that I found. So I'm gonna try to just find it and maybe we'll find some other stuff along the way. It was this really cute pink bat squishmallow and I thought that was really fitting with like Halloween coming up and everything. And I'm not a big Halloween person sue me but i can get behind a pink bat so let's just type in pink bat plushy and let's see what comes up oh yeah there it is there it is oh this one's really cute too so i do want to throw it out there i don't necessarily condone buying fake squishmallows like i'm not out here being like yeah go buy this fake you know i'm just merely here to buy them and hopefully not get scammed and let you know if it's a scam or not and review the quality review like just kind of the looks compare it to actual squishmallows and you can make your own informed choice if you would like to buy it um, but it's definitely uh, safer to do it on Amazon. I feel like personally, I will not buy any fake Squishmallows off of any like random website. I'm doing Amazon specifically because they're typically pretty good with their customer support and returns and everything. So even if I were to get scammed, then I feel pretty safe that I could get my money back or return or anything like that. So I'm just gonna take a little scroll. Yeah, it looks like we don't really have any fakes. Oh, that one. And I think that's a, that's a real one. And another tip for spotting fakes versus real ones, typically, typically, sometimes they do, but usually a fake will not have the word Squishmallow in the title. As you can see here, cute bat, plush toy, bat stuffed animal, kawaii pink bat, plush toy pillow, pink bat stuffed doll for Christmas birthday kids. So nowhere is Squishmallow in the title. Meanwhile, down here, that unicorn, this is an actual Squishmallow listing. This says Squishmallow's official Kelly toy plush. So just be on the lookout for that whenever you're shopping, if you're also looking for real ones and you don't want to get scammed. But yeah, this is the one I saw. I was like, oh, she's cute. She's kind of a cutie. We're going to go ahead and add her to that cart. So here's another one. This one is a ripoff of, I forget what the name of this one is, maybe Audrey in a pumpkin I can't remember but this one's pretty cute oh they also have the bat and they have wait did I see this one last video I can't remember but I'm not gonna get any of these because I'm not into the orange and black color scheme you know more of a pinky pastel kind of gal but where did I see I saw another one oh yeah this one I think we saw this one last time too yeah this is the same listing where I got this blueberry cow so if you want to see me unbox this one and like you know show this one that's in my last video as well but i saw this one and i thought this one was really unique so we got some more here this one's not really like squishmallowy it's a different design we have this one which is actually <laughs> this one actually is so cute i might just add this one because it's so cute i mean it has the squishmallow eyes right and it has this shape but it's got little legs and like it's a little avocado cow i don't know i'm gonna add it to the cards and we'll decide you know once um once I'm racking up some stuff here, but here we have official Squishmallows. This one's official, all of these. I've never seen this pumpkin pie in an acorn, what? 
I need to keep up more. Like, I am so behind. <laughs> okay, here's another bat that's definitely a ripoff of Tangy or whatever. Cute, but I will not get that one. Again, I'm not into the whole orange thing. Let's see. I was thinking, let's get some of these keywords and type these into the search bar and maybe that'll help us. So let's see. We got 12 inches Halloween orange bat plush toy, super soft and squishy. Okay, let's try uh, super soft squishy a uh, plush toy. Why was it saying Among Us? What the heck? <laughs> no, this is not what I want. Please, not the Among Us plushies. Okay, I'm just gonna start scrolling until I find something. Well, here's that one that we were just on. Um, I think I saw this one last time. That also, that looks pretty real. I don't know, is this one real? No, I don't think so. It looks pretty close though, but I'm not a dinosaur person, so I'm not gonna get that one. Okay, I'm just gonna go back to the page we were scrolling on. Um, let's see. Why is there Mario Among Us? Help! Okay, this looks like kind of a ripoff, it's, but it's got like a different style. Uh, this one too, they do have a Spider-Man Squishmallow that looks exactly like that. This turtle is so cute. Oh my goodness, look at this frog. He has seen some things in his time. Here's an official one. $25 though for a 5 inch? Amazon? No. Where are the fake ones? I want the fake ones. What? Why are there frogs with abs? Do I need to buy this? Do I need to buy this? Advanced sewing technology. <laughs> How much? $17 for the 13 inch? Okay. I'll just add it to the cart just in case. Oh my goodness. Look at this duck plush. <laughs> Stop. Why does Amazon have so many cute plushies? Ugh, just give me the fake squishmallows. So we have real, real. No, I, I don't want them. I want the fake ones. Give me the bad ones. <laughs> this pigeon is so cute. Stop. Okay, I'm going to keep going. We need the fake squishmallows. I'm having a hard time finding them. Okay, maybe we should try something else. Oh, wait, here's... Are these fakes? Yeah, those look a little fake. Those look a little sus. What else do they got? Minecraft axolotl. Perfect. Fake dragon. Fake cat. Fake sloth. I don't really want any more axolotls, so I'm gonna keep looking. Oh my goodness, I just saw this one at Walgreens today, and I wanted him, but he was $30 in Walgreens. Should I buy him? No, this is for fake Squishmallows. This is for fake ones. I need to chill out. <laughs> okay, I did see this one, though. This is pretty interesting. Now, this pineapple one is just like the Squishmallows one, but I don't think... Do they have a kiwi? Do they have an official kiwi? I don't know. That one's so funny. Look at him. <laughs> Let's see. Then they got rainbow and grapefruits. Okay. Size about eight inches. Why can't you give me an accurate size? Why are you so suspicious? So it's two of them and it's $25. I don't know. Whoa. Okay. I'm not like that into those. So we're going to keep scrolling. Oh, we actually have some owls here. These are fakes. Are they? Yeah. I do love me a Squishmallow that is embroidered. They have little hearts. I don't know. Happy Children's Day. <laughs> this is so random. I love Amazon listings sometimes because they're just like, what is going on? Why are there, why are there astronauts? What's happening? You know what? I think I'm going to go for these. It's a little expensive, but we're going to do it. Okay, let's see what else we got underneath. Oh my goodness, so cursed. Even though this one's real. I hate that this one is real. It's so cursed. Let's see. I think these little dinos are fakes. I see these dinos a lot. <gasps> I haven't seen a purple one though. That is so cute. Okay, there's only 10 left in stock. I'll add that one to the cart. I don't even know the sizes of all of these. I have no clue what's going on. Green mushroom? It's in the cart. It's in the cart. Okay, now I really want to see if we can find like some fake Bigfoot Squishmallows. I haven't come across any, but we're going to try because I really do love the Bigfoots, especially Zozo. So let's try searching Bigfoot Yeti uh, plush toy. Oh, I did not want to see feet on this morning. Nope. I really didn't. Okay, we have some actual Squishmallows, uh, little Benny with a hat, little Squeezemallow that is so overpriced. No, all of these are super expensive and real, unfortunately. He looks fake, but he's also real, unfortunately, very overpriced. He's from Five Below. Absolutely not. I'm just seeing a bunch of real ones. Oh, wait. 
What is this? What is this? Okay, I know it's not the same, but that is the exact face of the Benny Squishmallows. I'm adding this to the cart. $15? $16? Say less. It's already in my cart. I'm gonna count this, even though it isn't the typical Squishmallow shape, it's got his exact face. Like, come on. That was a score. That was a score. This is gonna be the best one out of the batch. I just know it. All right, so this is how my card is looking. We got the fake weird Benny. We have the green mushroom, the purple dino, the two owls. I need these, okay? Listen, this is not part of the video, but I need those. Avocado cow and this pink bat. I'm thinking... I'm gonna get rid of the cow, the avocado cow, because we already already have one that's like not technically a Squishmallow kind of ripoff, so I'm not gonna have two, even though it is the cheapest one at $10, so I'm gonna delete this one, but let me know, like, I can do a part three, maybe, and we can get that one in part three, but yeah, I think this is gonna be it. I'm gonna go ahead and check out, and then I will meet you back here once we have all the Squishmallows in our hands. So I have received everything. I'm very excited, but also scared to open them because if you haven't seen my part one video, um, everything came very flat and it's the same with this. How is there a plushie inside of this? <laughs> so they all come like vacuum sealed and stuff and it's just so hilarious. So we're just gonna cut into the first one here. No idea which one this is. It's gonna be a total surprise. Let's see. Oh, it's the little bats. Oh, look at her. Look at her. She's uh she's really suffocating in there. Let's uh let's release her. You know, there's a little little tear tab right here. Let's see if I can open this. Okay, I got it. There we go. Okay. So they fluff up a little bit when you take them out, but not very much. There's just like no stuffing in them, unfortunately. But I'm gonna try my best to like fluff her up a little bit so we can get kind of like, you know, a substantial review going. I also have a seam ripper and I have done this before where I literally cut open their butts and put more stuffing inside of them just to make them a little fluffier. So I'm not opposed to doing that if I need to, but let's take a look at this girl. I think she's real cute. She's real cute. The face embroidery, amazing, adorable. You know, her little wingsies, they're really cute. They feel really nice quality, honestly. My only critiques really are that she's a little bit on the smaller side. I would say she's close to like a seven inch Squishmallow. And again, just that she's <laughs> so flat, but maybe a tumble in the dryer or if you could rip her open and put more stuffing in would fix that. But otherwise, honestly, the quality of this one's pretty good. I'm gonna give her a five out of five, honestly. I think this one's pretty good. Next package, this one doesn't feel as flat. So this could be one of the uh, other types that I ended up ordering, but we'll see. Oh yes, <laughs> okay. <laughs> so this is like the Benny thing that I found. Oh, I almost cut his hand. Okay, let's pull him on out. Interesting, interesting, okay. So I thought that he would have like actual legs that stick out like his arms, but he doesn't. Like, I don't know if you can tell, he just has the, like these little lumps. They're just like little lumps that are his feet. So the only thing about this one is that it has the same face as like the Bigfoot Squishmallows, as you can see, you know, compared to my Squishmallows up there. It's just the same face, that's it. This isn't really like a, you know, like Squishmallow. Definitely not the same fabric, definitely not the same style and shape, but I thought he was funny and honestly, I kind of love him. I have to give him a five. <laughs> He's just so funny looking, like look at him. He's hilarious. Okay, next up, we got another hefty one. I don't think this is the Squishmallow. I think this is my impulse purchase. Oh no, I was wrong. Oh no, but I was, I was only half wrong. Hold on. <laughs> we also got these in here. This is definitely not a Squishmallow, but I had to get this. I had to. So I figured I would include it anyway. Um, this one also came kind of flat. He's a little flat as you can see. So here he is. I think he's absolutely hilarious. Um, the abs are just what killed me. It was so funny when I saw it on Amazon. What I say it's worth $17? Mm -hmm. eh. Eh, up for you, up to you to decide. But anyway, in the same vein of um, green plushies, we also have the mushroom that I ordered. And this one has a little green top and he didn't come 
super flat. I mean, like, he's flat, but it wasn't, like, severely vacuum sealed like the rest have been. Oh, it looks like there was a rip in the package. Maybe that's why. Here he is, though. He also needs some fluff in and just, you know, some help. The top of him is, like, a little bit, like, bulbous. <laughs> Like, it has kind of an odd shape, I would feel like, compared to the other mushrooms. Sadly, I don't have a bat squishmallow, so I can't compare an actual squishmallow bat to the pink bat, but I can do the mushrooms. So here they are. This is an 8-inch Malcolm um, authentic squishmallow, and here is the green one for comparison. So as you can see, the shapes are just, like, kind of different. Um obviously not as smooth as the genuine one but yeah that's kind of like the comparison you know he's still cute he's just a little wonky i'm gonna say mm, i want to say like 3.5 out of 5 just because his shape is just, <laughs> i don't know why it's it's so weird it's kind of similar to the other blue one that i got in the first one they're kind of the same lastly we have a giant box so first off we have the two owls that i got and they are in here together wow so we're just gonna pop these open and uh ooh, there was a little hiss that came out no these are these are pretty flat <laughs> So aside from the obvious lumpiness and wonkiness of just how they were packaged, um, these are pretty decent. I like the little heart embroidery. I'm trying to get this to focus here. The heart embroidery is really cute. I'm a big fan of embroidery. The embroidery of like the little spots here and the beak is pretty good. I would say the eyes are a little bit questionable. Let's see if I can get it to focus. The eyes are just slightly questionable. I wouldn't say they're as clean as the other ones and as actual Squishmallows. I would say the blue ones are even worse. Like as you can see, um, kind of like in this area, it's um, it's not as good as it could be, you know, but yeah, aside from the eyes, everything else is pretty good. So I would say like four out of five, you know, I'm just going to dock a point for the questionable eyeball embroidery. And unfortunately, I don't have any owls, um, authentic Squishmallow owls, so I can't compare them to a real one. Here's the dinosaur. Um, he's really suffering in there. Okay. Uh, yeah, so this was a very unfortunate shape to, <laughs> or a very unfortunate position to vacuum seal him in. How am I supposed to get him to be normal? I think he's suffered permanent damage. <laughs> I do like that the spikes are just like the same fabric as his whole body. It's not like felt or like a different fabric. Usually they tend to do that. I don't think... Um, they're supposed to be shaped like a triangle, you know? I think this is a little excessive. I don't think I would recommend this one, especially of how unfortunately they vacuum sealed him. If they do that for every single one, then it borderline, like, almost gets ruined. Like, I'm gonna see if the dryer can fix it. Um, yeah, this is my least favorite, unfortunately. Um, maybe the dryer will give him a second chance in my mind, but for this, I'm gonna just say two out of five, like... Don't waste your money on this one. <laughs> I just feel like the tail is also very excessive. Like, this is, like, his whole body. Like, it should be, like, more like that, you know? Not so bulbous. <laughs> so those are all the Squishmallows that we reviewed today. Um, let me know which one is your favorite. Oh, I can't hold all of these. <laughs> I think my favorite of the bunch is definitely the bat. She's super cute and she just needs a little extra stuffing. That's really it. But I, I really like her. She feels really, really nice. So she's my fave. And then again, least favorite bottom of the barrel. Definitely this abomination. Yeah. <laughs> And honorable mention to this thing, which is almost like a Benny Squishmallow, but not. He's just... Look at him go. He's just a little guy. So that's all the Squishmallows we have for today. I very much enjoyed doing part two to this fake Squishmallow series. Let me know if you want to see more. Thank you so much for watching though. Definitely leave me a comment if you want part three. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy Squishmallows and Animal Crossing and plushies as you can see i'm very into that so thank you so much again for watching and i will see you in the next one